Welcome to Tranquil Tuesday. Today we are going to focus on spinal mobility. Do sit comfortably either with your legs crossed or if you prefer stretch out your legs and separate your feet for balance. We're going to start off working on the cervical spine, the neck. So allowing your head to drop forwards, bring your chin down towards your chest. Roll your head gently towards your right shoulder as you breathe in. And forwards as you breathe out. To your left shoulder as you breathe in. And forwards as you breathe out. And again, roll to the right shoulder as you breathe in. And forwards as you breathe out. To your left shoulder as you breathe in and forwards breathing out. Raise your head slowly upright. Keep your shoulders relaxed and down. Incline your head towards your right shoulder as if someone were pulling your ear towards your shoulder. Feel the stretch on the left side of your neck. Raise up on an in-breath. As you breathe out, incline over to the left side. Raising up as you breathe in. And once again, as you breathe out, over to the right. Raise your head upright as you breathe in. And now over to the left. And raising upright as you breathe in. Keeping your chin level, slowly turn your head as far to the right as you can, looking over your right shoulder. Coming back to the central position on an in-breath. And as you breathe out, turning to the left, look over your left shoulder. Return on the in-breath. Once again, turning to the right, breathing out. Come back to the center as you breathe in. And turning to the left as you breathe out. And returning to the central position as you breathe in. We're now going to do the rotational movement. If you have any difficulty in uh, rolling your head backwards in that position, please just roll your head from side to side. So when you are ready, allow your head now to drop forwards, chin to chest. Roll the head towards the right shoulder as you breathe in. Rolling back as you breathe out. To the left as you breathe in and forwards breathing out and again to the right as you breathe in roll your head back as you breathe out to the left as you breathe in and gently forwards on your out breath pause let your head hang forwards for a moment now roll your head towards your left shoulder as you breathe in. Roll your head back and breathe out. To the right shoulder as you breathe in. And forwards on your out breath. And again roll to the left as you breathe in. Rolling your head back, breathe out. To the right as you breathe in and slowly forwards on your out breath. Touch your chin in towards the jugular notch. Feel the stretch going right up to the top of your spine. Now release your chin an inch or two away from your chest. Twist your chin slowly up to the right and look up to the ceiling on the right side and down to the centre then up to the left and down 
into the center, up to the right, and down to the center, and up to the left, and down to the center. Holding your chin an inch or two away from your chest, just simply shake your head. And slowly as you shake your head, come upright. Good. And now, stretching out both of your legs with your feet together. Place your right hand onto your right kneecap and take your left hand onto the floor behind you. We're going to turn to the left side. Take an in-breath and as you breathe out, very gently turn to the left and look over your left shoulder. Breathe in, come back to the centre position. We're going to repeat this five times more. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in and come back to centre. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in and come back to centre. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, returning to centre. Two more. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return to centre. And the last time, breathe out and twist. Breathe in as you return to the centre position. Change hands. Left hand to left knee, right hand onto the floor behind you. Drop your shoulders down. Take an in-breath. As you breathe out, twist. Look over your shoulder, your right shoulder. Breathe in, come back to centre. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, come back to centre. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, returning to the centre. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, come back to centre. Two more. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, come back to centre. And the last one. Breathe out and twist. And breathing in, you return to centre. These twisting movements put gentle pressure on the roots of spinal nerves and help to release tension. They also encourage the natural fluids to move around the spinal cord and to bathe the spinal cord. Our following movements are forward stretches to stretch the supporting muscles to your spine. So with this one, do not force or pull yourself down. Let the natural stretch of the body happen. We're going to slide the hands towards the side of the knees. Bending the elbows, roll down and let your forehead drop down towards your knees. Breathing out. Breathe in and come upright. We do this five times more. Breathe out. Down, forehead towards your knees. Breathe in, come upright. Breathe out, come down, forehead towards the knees. Breathe in, come upright. Breathe out, roll down. Breathe in, come upright. Two more. Breathe out, roll down. Breathe in, come upright. And one more. Breathe out, roll down. And breathing in, return to the upright position. At 
first there is sometimes some difficulty in stretching the spinalis erecticus muscles on either side of your spine, but gradually and with practice that will become much easier. Our following movement is to bend the right knee like this, just bring your right knee up and place your right hand on the inside of the leg. Take your left hand onto the ground behind you. Okay, breathe in, breathe out and turn to the left. Breathe in, back to center six times. Breathe out and turn to the left. Breathe in, come back to center. Breathe out and turn. Breathe in to center. Breathe out and turn. Breathe in to center. Breathe out and turn. Breathe in to center and one more. Breathe out and turn. Breathe in to center and release that leg. These are all preparatory exercises that move us towards the classical yoga posture work, the Hatha yoga. Bending your left knee Bring your left arm onto the inside of the leg and hold onto your ankle. Sitting upright, take your right hand behind your back. Relax your shoulders, balance your head. Okay? Breathe out and twist. Breathe in to center. Breathe out and twist. to center, breathe out and twist, breathe in to center, breathe out and twist, breathe in to center, breathe out and twist, breathe in to center, one more, breathe out and twist, and breathe in as you return to the center. Stretch out your legs, bring feet and legs together. Now we're going to slide the hands down to the mid shin area, dropping the elbows downward. You roll your chin to your chest and drop your forehead towards your knees. Now don't worry if you're up here, just let the head drop forwards because your head is the heaviest bony structure of the body. It will help the leverage and the stretching of the supporting muscles to your spine. Are we ready? We're sitting upright. Place your hands onto your knees. Breathe in. Breathe out. Mid shim, slide down one. Breathe in, sit upright. Slowly. Breathe out, slide down two. Breathe in, come up. Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, sit upright. Three more. Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, come upright. Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, come upright. Last one, breathe out, slide down, elbows dropping to the floor, and breathe in as you return upright. Bending your right knee, bring your foot up, and take your left arm over your right knee, and have your hand upright, and you're gazing towards your fingers, Take your left hand onto the floor for balance. Okay. Breathe in at center. Breathe out as you turn to the right. 
Breathe in, come back to center. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return. 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 And the last time. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in as you return. Release your arm and stretch out your right leg. Bending your left knee, bring the foot up. Get a comfortable upright position. Take your right arm over that knee so the elbow is against the side of your knee and your hand remains upright. You gaze at your fingers, keeping the head level. Take your left hand onto the floor behind you for balance and support. Breathe in. Breathe out and turn to the left. Twist. Breathe in and return. Keep your head level. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return. Two more. Breathe out and twist. Breathe in, return. And the last one. Breathe out and twist. Breathing in, return. And lower your hand and release your leg. Bringing your legs and feet together, we're now going to slide our hands down towards the ankles. Don't worry if you don't get near your ankles. Slide your hands down as far as you can comfortably go. So it's optional, you don't have to, you mustn't pull yourself down, you don't have to slide to ankle level. Do whatever your body will allow you to do because you're lengthening and stretching the supporting muscles to your spine. These are the youth giving postures, keep you very upright as you get older. Placing your hands onto your knees, legs and feet together, take an in-breath, on your out-breath, slide your hands down, let your head drop down towards your knees, breathe in, come up, persuading that stretch of the spine, breathe out, slide down, breathe in, come up, Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, come up. Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, come up. Two more. Breathe out, slide down. Breathe in, come up. And the last one. Breathe out, slide down. And breathe in, coming up. You can sit with your feet spaced apart and your hands on your knees to do this rolling movement. It's called a Sufi roll. You go round like that. Or you may, if you wish to, sit cross-legged. Placing your hands onto your knees Allow your body weight to drop forwards. Roll to the right, taking your chin over towards the right knee. Roll to the right, to the side. Roll back to the left. Roll forwards. Roll right and back and left and forwards. Roll right and back and left and forwards, three more, roll right, and back, and left, and forwards, 
Roll right and back and left and forwards. One more. Roll right and back and left and forwards. Lengthen your spine as you let your head drop down towards the floor. Just see if your head can go down towards the floor and release. The other way, towards your left knee. Sufi roll. Roll left to the side and back and over. Forwards. Roll left and round the back, over to the side and forwards. Roll left and back and right and forwards. Three more. Roll left back and right and forwards, left and back and right and forwards, last one, left and back and right and forwards, drop your head down towards the floor and raise upright, coming onto your knees. The cat posture, it's a wave-like wave movement of the spine, we're going to finish with these, so separate your knees hip distance apart and your hands beneath the level of your shoulders, toes straight, drop your back, raise your head, breathe in, look up, breathing out, arch your back and tense. Drop the back, raise the head, breathe in, look up. Breathe out, arch your back and tense. Drop your back, raise your head, breathe in, look up. Breathe out, arch your back and tense. Drop your back, raise your head, breathe in, look up. Breathe out, arch your back and tense. Drop your back, raise your head, breathe in, look up. Breathing out, arch your back and tense. Push up, one more. Drop your back, raise your head, breathe in, look up. Breathing out, arch your back and tense and drop into neutral and sit down onto the mat. A full forward reach. Now don't worry if you can't touch your toes, it doesn't matter, do whatever you can. Breathe in as you raise your arms above your head, stretching. Breathe out, reach for your toes, lay your body down towards your legs. One more time, breathe in, stretch up, Breathing out, reach for your toes. Hold the body down. And then release. That is the end of part one of our spinal mobility exercises. I hope you enjoyed that. Namaste.